This is like the biggest fish ever caught. On one of these rods. On one of these rods. Super cheap three pound test. Ooh, nice. Guys, we are back with the tiny rod from Proficiency. Uh, proficiency. Proficiency. I'm leaving that in there. The proficiency. Okay, the proficiency? Mike Tyson. Okay, Mike Tyson. Proficiency? <laughs> we should dub Mike in there. That's ludicrous that you talk like that. <laughs> hey, Big Mike, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. <laughs> And I loved it. So the other day we fished with this tiny rod and reel on top of that bridge and we didn't get the big fish that we wanted. We caught, you know, we caught some fish like around this size, but we're trying to get some fish around this size. So we are back today. Let's see if we can get revenge. So you would say that the goal is to catch a fish bigger than the rod? Yes, that's the goal. Fish bigger than the rod. Let's go. All right, guys. So we're going to see if we can catch a big fish with this tiny little rod. We decided to go from the bridge down here and I already see a carp. So I think this is going to work. Yeah. Yeah. The drag can't be too tight because it'll pop the line real easy. It's only got 35 yards of line. You know, we like to promote positivity and stuff on the channel, guys. So I just want to remind everyone that we believe in you. So you need to believe in you as well. Anything that comes up, just know that you're strong enough to get through it. With that being said, tight lines. Let's try and catch a big fish using a micro rod because we didn't get it the other day we're gonna get it today for sure fingers crossed and uh yeah enjoy the episode keep your head up keep moving forward and keep those lines tight baby it looks like there's a big carp down there mike oh he's on it oh come on come on hey guys this is monster mike and you're watching monster mike fishing I gotta talk quiet because they're teeing off behind us and we don't wanna disturb them. But there's a giant carp swimming around Mike's bait. Uh, he's got the, the micro rod that we were using the other day or from the video from the other day. If you missed that, we were on the bridge right here and Mike caught a few fish from the bridge using the small rod. But we wanted to come back and try for the big one because you know, we don't give up on this channel. We don't give up at all. Hey guys, remember if you wanna use our lures, Go into the link in the description below. Livingston has all the Monster Mike series lures. If you want the nines optics like we wear, you know, link is in the description below. Everything, you wanna buy the shirts and stuff. We got Peacock Bass shirts, we got Monster Mike fishing shirts, we got all kinds of stuff. Mugs, socks, hats, hoodies. Link is right below the video. All you gotta do is click it and you go get some, some new swag, you know what I'm saying? And send us a picture. Send us a picture or a video of you wearing it. And you know what? We'll put it in the video. We'll give you a shout out. That's it, it's that simple, you know? So you can win a shout out with the trivia questions or you can win a shout out wearing our gear. That's it. Let's have fun with the guys, go support the channel and uh, we're gonna go catch a fish. Well, Mike is, I'm the cameraman. <laughs> it's shout out time. Congrats, Transcendent, you are the shout out winner of the day. You got all the trivia questions right in the last video. Remember, there's a chance to win a shout out at the end of every episode. All you gotta do is comment your answers and you got a chance to win. But you must be subscribed to the channel with your notifications on. All right, let's get it out there. Let it sink, no ducks. I don't want no ducks. A duck is a bird that can get away from me. Always trying to steal my bait. <laughs> Stupid ducks. Heard they taste delicious though. Oh, carp on. Almost. <gasps> he just ate it. He just ate it. He just ate it. We did it. And you're on. And you're on. There's a tree in the way. There's a tree in the way. He's pulling drag. Oh, watch that. Watch the edge. Watch the edge. I see him. He's over here. <laughs> You're not moving them too much, huh? Three pounds, guys. This is three pound test. Three pound test, guys. 
we, we're making miracles happen. This is like the biggest fish ever caught. On one of these rods. On one of these rods. It's the proficiency telescoping micro rod. I don't even know if the carp knows he's on. <laughs> let's just, let's just, hey, we gotta film this whole fight. You know why, Brian? We need the time. Hey, look at the size but of that But it's entertaining carp. because it's like my arms are getting a workout and there's monster fish all over the place. I don't think he knows he's hooked, but he's gonna no. know once he sees I'll... my ugly ass. Yeah. There he is, there he is, there he is. Can you guys see him? Can you guys see him in there? What about now? That's why we use the Nines optics. Look at him, look at him, look at him, look at him. There we go. Damn, tree. All right, two minutes in so far, Mike. <laughs> yeah, he, he don't know. This is, this is gonna be a minute. This is a little ride. There it is. There it is. Bro, that's a big fish. Could you imagine if you got the bigger one? We'd be fighting it for like an hour. I don't want to. I would have gone home. <laughs> I would have gone home and just left you here. Still this, reeling it in. Yeah, this is pretty fun. It sure looks fun. It is. It's actually like, it's, it's like. Pro probably more fun than holding a camera. <laughs> This is when I get to that spot. I do like the sound of that drag, though. The drag sounds nice. Ooh, watch the stick. Watch the stick. So I hope you guys enjoy these fun videos that Mike and I are doing. Because um, we're this is what it's about. Creativity, being outdoors, and having fun, hanging out with friends, whatever it is, you know, that's what we're trying to promote here on this channel. And I just want to say, for those of you who are going through something right now, no fear because life always gives us challenges and those challenges always make us stronger in the end so if you're going through something right now you're dealing with something right now just know that you have the strength to get through it and once you do use those lessons use everything you learned in that moment of downtime in, the, in that dark time or that rough time use what you learned during that to find more success in the future guys always keep your head up we love you enjoy the episode Three minutes, Mike. We're gonna be able to monetize this mother. <laughs> uh, this, this video. I, I almost said a bad word, guys. <laughs> mofo. I meant to say mofo. He don't even know he's hooked. He's like, huh? Ooh, ooh. He just saw you. He just saw you. Now you gotta get him back in. <laughs> I ain't gonna lie, this is pretty fun. That thing is screaming. Remember, can't let him get too far. You only got 35 yards. You only got 35 yards. You're right. You're right. You're right. only got 35 yards. There's a hole here. Wait, wait. Don't go past the tree line. Don't go past the tree line. That's our limit because of the golfers. See, guys, you know, we're out here fishing, but we got to respect the golfers, too. Big hmm. Four minutes. Four minutes. I'm so glad that we tried for this again. Look at him. There it is. Ooh, nice splash. I'm so glad. I'm put a little, oh no, I can't put no tension on it. Right? No, that's that's super cheap three pound test. I'm, I'm only assuming it's super cheap because typically these rods, even though they're cool, the line is not always the best quality line that's on them. Ooh, nice. This is how we do it, guys. Just come out every day, have fun, doing what we love, enjoying fishing, sharing our adventures with you guys. Comment below if you enjoy hanging out with me and Mike on our little adventures and drop some comments on what you want to see us do next, you know? Oh, and good news, my boat is finally done. We're gonna be out in that salt water soon. Snook, sharks. tarpon, sharks, snapper, permit. And you know what? I'm gonna have to learn how to catch a lot of these fish because this is my first time with a boat. So it's gonna be an adventure and you guys can come and learn with us. Is he tired yet? No, he's still, well, yep. Yeah. Ooh, we're in the grass. Look at it, look at it. 
might have to get down there. You know what? You don't even have to bring them out. If you just get down there, you can land them from right there. Yeah, he's bigger than the, he's definitely bigger than the rod. <laughs> that drag has not stopped screaming since you hooked him. I'm just going to sit right here. Ow, something just stuck me in the butt cheek. You're used to that. Yeah. All right, seven minutes. One more minute and this video is fully monetized. <laughs> Plus all the stuff I got to add into it. <laughs> but the thing is we can't fight it any faster because the line is cheap three pound test. And that fish, what do you say? 10, 15 pounds maybe? <laughs> Because they are fat. They're heavier than, you know, what a bass would be at that size, so. Oh! I guess he's not ready yet. I'm going to grab his tail. <laughs> Them gears are going to melt. I'll tell you what, though. If, if, you're, if you're up north and you, like, fish for crappie and bluegill or you're on a golf course like this and you just want to bring a little rod this thing is perfect because it literally the Got tip look, is like I, a telescoping rod so it gets smaller I, look I'm, I'm i'm just you know i'm just the best fisherman in the world and i got a giant fish with a tiny rod that's all i know i just want to let them know all right eight minutes well, mike get, well me and brian's the best fisherman in the world i don't want him yeah, I get, I get he, jealous. He, he has a flick of the wrist. I do got that flick of the wrist. But look, guys, we got him. All right, the moment of truth. Picking. Well. Bro, he wet my shoes. Damn, you got he him. wet my size three. You got the Gordons wet? The Gordon. <laughs> I won't be allowed. I actually wish I had a little audience right now. All yeah. Right, let me let me land him because I know your your memory is about to. Get yeah. Well, the thing is, you can't really land him until he's ready to get landed. Yeah. All right. This is it because I'm I'm more tired than he is. This has been a nine-minute fight. But it's nine. three-pound test. So, <gasps> did we break a record? We're gonna have to look up three-pound test records. When they say reel him to the tip, literally. To the tip. Don't do it. Don't run. Uh, I think he's finally good. Yep. Jeez. Yeah, let's just lift him from there. Ah! Ooh, guess not. Guess not. See? You guys think we're, you know, we're not really milking this at all. This is legit how long it's taken to catch this fish. It's like I want to pull the line, but I can't. Yep. And sometimes these medium carp, they got, they got more energy than them big, big ones. One of them 40 pounders Bro, probably would have been landed be already. I'll be pissed if he came off after all this fight. Nah. I see that hook in him. About 15 people already finished the whole round of golf and you still here fishing the same fish, Mike. <laughs> it's lunchtime. <laughs> I'm trying to go home too, bro. Yeah. I just I just I just wanna go eat. You know what? I tighten up the My jacket. water my water is like all the way all in right. the truck. Oh no! Oh I'm sliding. Oh okay. his feet got wet. So uh, my water is in the truck. Mike's water is in his shoes. <laughs> Because I can't give him that, 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 you know what I'm saying? No, I if know. If I give him an inch, he gives me a mile. Yeah. I'm trying to make something make sense. Yeah. <laughs> I don't even know what I'm saying. Usually all I can give is an inch. Big fish on shark. No. <laughs> I'm getting bored, Mike. <laughs> all right, I got him, bro. My, my hand's getting and, tired and, from and holding the... Is it crazy how much energy that this fish has? I, you know what? I they I haven't seen them really fight this much. That's probably because the drag is like not, you know. Try not, I try not to tail. get yeah, get the tail and underneath, rod in your mouth. We're just gonna lift it, dehook it, and put them back in. There it is. There it is on the mini rod, man. Look, that's a beautiful fish, beautiful carp. Put up a fight. You know, I can't believe you didn't get tired. You must have been on that uh. Cuban coffee. <laughs> All right, guys, it is trivia time. 
Get these following questions right for your chance to win a shout out in the next video. Trivia question number one, what pound test is on this reel? And trivia question number two, why did we have to use this rod again today? Comment your answers below and we're gonna pick one lucky winner to be shouted out in the next episode. Also, to win a shout out, make sure you hit that notification bell and be subscribed to the channel for your chances to win as well. Catch you next time.